So one of the biggest systems we have that helps us sleep is the homeostatic sleep drive. So what this is, is essentially when you spend more time awake, you build up a sleepiness which makes you want to sleep. And the more time you spend sleeping, you build up a wakefulness which makes you want to be awake. So essentially it's a drive state, like, like eating is a, is, a, is a drive state, so hunger being a drive state. The less you eat, the more you get hungry, the more you need to eat. It's exactly the same with sleep. It is changeable. So there are variables that affect that homeostatic sleep drive. And there is another part of our, our sleep that is called the circadian rhythm. And that is where we have timings in the day and the night where we're more likely to do certain things, like we get a little dip during the day where we feel a bit sleepy. That doesn't mean for everyone that we need to go to sleep, but it just means you're more likely in that time if you do certain activities that make you sleepy, you might find the need to sleep more than at other times. Um, and so we know that there are certain times during the day where you're more likely to need to sleep and more likely to need to be awake and that there are factors that affect this. But effectively, the homeostatic sleep drive is the way that your sleep works. So the longer you are awake, the more likely you are needing to sleep.